Okay, so if you have an S550 Mustang or an S197 Mustang and your puddle lamp does this, I'm going to show you how you can easily change it in less than five minutes. Um, it doesn't really require any tools, only a small screwdriver or a small pocket knife. And um, this needs to be done when the pony logo starts to distort or creates blurs um, or if you want to change it out to an aftermarket puddle lamp and the one I got from Ford only cost me $30 this is for the passenger side uh, if you want to do the driver side it's obviously going to be another $30 but they're pretty easy to do let me show you if I pull it out of the box here there's the new puddle lamp okay um, it has two electrical prongs and it has this snap clip here okay so the way you remove these is you have to place a small screwdriver or pocket knife into this snap clip so that you can push it in and then the light should just fall out of the side mirror okay so let's show you how to do that really quick I'm going to be using a small pocket knife here. Okay, so what I want to do is place my small pocket knife right where that snap clip is, and then I want to push inwards. By pushing inwards, the lamp bottom pops out, and then I can just pull the whole assembly out. Okay, it's connected with two electrical prongs right there. Just remove that. I'm trying to do this with one hand so I can show you what it looks like. Then you take your new puddle lamp, place that into the electrical connector. With two hands hold on a sec okay once you got the electric con connector back in make sure you put this side in first if you put the snap snap uh, piece in first you're gonna have a bad time so make sure you put the front side in first okay Sometimes if it doesn't go in, then you just gotta make sure that the wires aren't in the way. So put the front side in first, and then the back side will snap right in. Okay, and there you go. Now you wanna make sure you did it correctly, so we're just gonna test to see if the puddle lamp is there. Um, can't see it on the ground, so we're just gonna test it on our hands, and there it is. Looks pretty good. Um, you might have to wait until it gets a little darker to make sure it works properly. Okay, so hopefully this video was helpful for you.